Hello class, my name is Mrs. Lawson and I am so excited that you are coming to practice math with me today. Today we're going to be doing some subtracting and when we subtract today we're going to take everything away. Subtracting is taking something away. Sometimes we call it minus as well. Sometimes we only take away part of a number but today we're taking it all away. So if we have zero, we'll take away zero. So our answer is zero. If we have one, we're gonna take away everything. We're gonna take away one. So our answer is zero. If we have two, we're gonna take away two. And our answer will be zero. Three minus three is zero. Four minus four is zero. Five minus five is zero. Six minus six is zero. Seven minus seven is zero. Eight minus eight is zero. Nine minus uh, nine is zero. And 10 minus 10 is zero. These are gonna be easy. This answer is the same every single time. It's zero or nothing because we took everything away. Let's take a closer look at that. Class, we are learning to subtract a number from itself. Here I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. If I have 10 sticks, but I take all 10 of them away, how many sticks do I have left? Zero. Class, if I have 9 leaves, oh, and 9 leaves blow away, how many leaves am I going to have left? Zero. I'm going to have zero leaves. Class, if I have eight sticks and I take all eight of them away, how many do I have left? I have zero. Class, if I have seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven flowers, and I take all seven away, how many do I have left? I have zero left. If I have six flowers and I take six flowers away, how many flowers do I have left? Zero. Class, if we had a number line, zero, one, two, three, four, five, and if we went back, five spaces, one, two, three, four, five, we would be at zero. Five, take away one, two, three, four, five, is zero. Five, subtract five, is zero. Class, if we have four and we take away four, we could look at it on the number line. We're at four and we go back four jumps. One, two, three, four. Four, take away four, is zero. If we have three, take away three. We can look at our number line. We start at three and we step back three steps. One, two, three. Three, subtract three. Our answer is you guessed it, it's zero. Class, if we have two and we take two away, we can use our number line. Two, take away one, two. Our answer would be zero. Two, take away two is zero. Anytime that you take zero away from a number, your answer is always going to be zero. Even if our question is zero, take away zero. We have nothing and we take nothing away. Class, I am so glad that you came to practice your math facts with me today. I had fun taking everything away. When we take away a number from itself or take everything away, the answer is always zero. Well, class, I hope that you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.